Oh, make it stop. Make it stop. Ugh. He didn't even steal anything. He just put this on. Who does this? Welcome to the vlog today. It's my day off and you know my days off always have crazy videos because I get to do stuff that I don't get to do at work and it's crazy and it's it's actually not crazy. I don't do anything like serious. That's my cat right there. I actually got some sleep. That's a plus. Let me turn this light on so it doesn't look like a cave. Oh, it was so good to sleep, bro. Last night I was like after... 16 hours of work and only four hours of sleep. I would. This is not a joke. This is February 2006, which was five months old. I'm like, if I can shed content, I will end up being. I think spring might actually be here. Look at that. Today's gonna be an interesting video because I'm gonna do this 10 things thing and me and, and, and Amanda are gonna go to Qdobo. Or is it Qdoba? Qdoba or Qdobo? You always find something when you're doing the bed. There's always gold, there's always treasure at the end of the bed. Today I found Groovy socks. Or these shoes. I don't I don't know. I guess she was at like a a, a concert last night. And hippies were there. Ah That was supposed to be an overhead flip. So I don't know if anyone's done a video like this, but I figured it's an authentic way of expressing yourself. I feel like on YouTube there's a lot of forced positivity. And I know that that was an issue once, and I want to counteract that. The point is, we all have things we don't like about ourselves, and when we hide behind them and pretend that we don't like them, or pretend that we don't have those issues, then it's not real. So if you can confront the 10 things that you don't like about yourself, maybe either you fix them or at least you're honest with yourself and you know what you don't like. I really have to say that when I was making this list, it was really hard to stop at 10. And I don't want this to be like, you know a getting down on yourself party. I don't want this to seem like I'm bashing myself, but I want some raw honesty and I think that's what this channel is about. No? No? Is the lighting better now? Because I know I look like I was in a cave just now. Is the lighting better? Well anyway, this is 10 things I hate about myself. Cue the intro. <laughs> All right, number one is snapping at people. I don't like that I snap at people. I don't like that I have a short temper sometimes. I know it may not seem that way, but um, yeah. You stepped on my foot. No, it's cool. No, it's just, it's just new shoes. It's just new shoes. I don't like that I can't let things go. Letting things go is really difficult for me. When there's a problem, I need to either solve it or I need to really make sure that the person who has the problem it's firmly okay, and they really don't give a shoot about the problem. You know what I mean? Are, are you sure you wanted me to paint it red? Because I, I know that you you bleed sometimes, so um, I don't want you to re I don't want you to remember blood every time you come home. You know, you know. I'll, I'll paint it blue. I'll paint it white. White could make us think heaven. You know. I, I just when you said I loved it, I just didn't believe it. You know. I know probably people don't agree with this one, so some people do. I don't know, but I don't like my nasally voice. I feel like I sound... 
Someday we'll find it. The rainbow connection. The lovers. The dreamers. And me. I don't like my side profile. My side profile annoys me a lot. That's why I'm always looking at the camera forward facing. I feel like I either look like, uh... I hate that I'm an angry drunk. I hate that I, I start out fun and then eventually I either start going like, um... I, I was pretty mean to that cashier. Uh, my, my mother was a cashier, so I guess I was taking it out on them, you know? I hate my stubbornness. Sometimes. Sometimes I think it's cute AF. Um, I'm a stubborn person. I don't like to change. I don't like to, to agree. I don't like to do what you want to do. I don't care what you think. I don't care what anyone thinks. And that's dangerous. That's when I don't like it. Because when I don't care, I push people away. When I do care, then I'm a good person. But, Or, you know, sometimes I'm just like, No, I'm going to graduate school. That's, that's good stubbornness. Or, No, I don't like that person. That's kind of bad stubbornness, you know? I hate my addictive personality. I, I don't like that I get addicted to things real f Real easy. I hate my ego, sometimes. I don't have a big ego, I just have the biggest one on the island. All right, yeah, the ego gets in the way sometimes. Sometimes at work, I can't be wrong. Sometimes in my relationship, I can't be wrong. Sometimes I take things a little bit too, uh... What do you mean the A was great? It's not exceptional? Do you know how much hard work I did to get that A? Great? What am I, the great bang? No, it's not Big Bang, it's Great Bang. So now you think you know more than science? Or more than me in science? Why are you messing up my words? Are you scared that I'm more articulate than you? I hate my desire for revenge. If you wrong me, I want to get you back. I want to hurt you. I want to... You see? That's not good. And finally, I know this covers a lot of what I've said before, but number 10 is I don't like how confrontational I am. I like arguments, I like fights, and I like tension. I think that's why I am a writer, because you can't have a story without tension. So, yeah, this has been a real liberating experience. And I, I can really be honest with you here, there's way more than 10, bro. But anyway, that's my 10 things that I don't like, and I'll probably have another list one day. So, let's get on with the day. Ten. Told you my vlogs are crazy when I'm off. I can't do this stuff at work. People would have me arrested. I'd be in like those plastic cuffs. Advertisement. I hate when people say advertisement, man. That is not how it's pronounced. Who are you, advertisement? Hey, did you see that Payless advertisement? Dude. I think what I'm gonna do today is show you guys how I outline, um, my homework. And then I'm gonna save the trip for tomorrow. Cool? Coolio. So, first I like to set up my to-do list here. I'm going to like all my notes here, and then I still have some classes here that I need to do. I also want to create a training schedule for my FDNY test. Um, so first we'll go to Problem of Evil, it's spelled problem wrong, but you know, it's only for my viewing. Uh, now the good thing about this to-do list is they let you, it's, it's called any do, okay? Any dot do. And um, you click notes, and you can add a note. So basically what I'll do is go back to where my school um, listing is. And I have all the classes here listed. And I'll go to the problem of evil, which is the class. That'll load. It'll go to modules. And this is, again, to set up for the week. So that I have everything in one place. 
and I, I don't need to, to keep going back to the school thing because the school thing is kind of hard to navigate on a cell phone and it's not synced through all devices and everything. So here we are, uh, week 13 of the semester. It's got like, you know, activities of the week, everything that's needed. Uh, so I'll go to what I need to participate in, which is the discussion. <clears throat> Sorry about that. So I'll go to the discussion board here, and whatever question was posted here, um, I will copy that, because that's the activity part of the class. I'll go back to my to-do list, and I will paste it in there. And that's what I know I need to do, uh, you know, for the week there. I also need to do the final. That's due May 7th. So I'll put the final as the top priority there. And then that's done. You just X out. And that class is set for the week. So let's go to mechanics of writing. Mechanics of writing is a little bit more... Uh, there's a lot more work in that class. No offense to the problem of evil. So, um, yeah, that, that's how I, I do that. But uh, let's look at the mechanics of writing. Says so the student evaluation is due. I'll do that later. Um, so I'll go to the assignments part. Each class is different in the way that they, they run, you know, handle the online stuff. How it's separated and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, I'm not I'm not gonna bore you guys with this stuff, but that that's how I do it. I copy and paste, and I, I make a to do list, and it keeps you organized for the the week, and you can it syncs across all your platforms and stuff like that. So, if you can get a leg up and do that at the beginning of the week, with ever work whichever type of work you have to do. That's a real plus, and it'll keep you organized because organization is key. Or maybe it's not gonna work for you at all. Maybe you just freaking like to drink, and maybe when you're drunk, you're better. I don't know. But tomorrow, Qdobo, Qdoba, um, I'll film that trip. But as for today, I need to do homework. So I don't have anything left for you guys. Sorry. Someday we'll find it, the rainbow connection, the lovers, the dreamers.